Hi, it's Grammy from Grammy and Grandpa Read, and today I have a book for you called If Animals Trick or Treated, and it is written by Anne Whitford Paul, and pictures are done by David Walker. If Animals Trick or Treated, Mama and Owlet at the pumpkin stall would first choose a pumpkin like Owlet, small. They'd carve two round eyes, two pointy ears. That pup would carve her ears with, carve hers with things like spears. Hatchling would beg Papa Cro Crocodile to carve his pumpkin a sneery smile. If animals trick-or-treated when Mama and Owlet would decorate trees with cobwebs swish swaying in the breeze, Anteater and Pup would shove with their snouts to the whoopity loop orange and black streamers about. Vulture chicks would scat scatter fresh skeleton bones close close to a cluster of old tombstones. If animals trick-or-treated, Owl would fly in his super bird cape. Piglet would waddle in a mummy tape. Zebra uh, foal would prance, prance in his costume of spots. Little leopard would run wearing stripes, lots and lots. Panther would don a tall witch hat and hold paws with her spooky cub, black cub cat. If animals trick-or-treated, Owlet and friends would knock, knock, knock at nests outside dens and under rocks, promising a trick if they didn't get treats. Parrot would give out her yummy seed sweets. Armadillo would offer chocolate ants Elephant, candy leaf plants? Bear surprise, honey gummy bears. Raccoon, his famous garbage fudge squares. Then stuffed to his beak with no room for more, Owlet would flap flap his wings and soar. To mama under the the moon's spooky light, they'd read scary stories and shiver with fright. But sitting close, feather to feather, they'd feel brave and cozy together. That's it. I hope that you like this book. Please subscribe to our channel and like the video.